guys welcome back welcome back to another airbrush makeup video if you guys aren't subscribed make sure you guys subscribe down below as promised today i'm gonna do a colorful look i'm gonna be using several brands so bear with me everything that i will be using it's gonna be down on my description i am so happy just to sit down and record it takes a good 20 minutes to just sit down set up fix the camera the settings you know different lights um i turn on my background lights as you guys see and I just showered it and it's a little bit hot so I was like you know what let me just keep my hair up so I could be fr nice and fresh and yeah guys let's jump right into the video but first things first guys you guys have been asking me um what do I moisturize my face with um it just all depends on summer I use water based um moisturizer this one's from Trader Joe's which I love it kind of reminds me of the Neutrogena Hydro Booster I love that one by the way too um just something that it's not too like too heavy that's what I call it well for myself because I am an oily grease ball by the way guys I am home alone with the Calypso aka the toddler so if he comes crying he knows every time I turn the lights I'm gonna do makeup and here he comes yes puppy he's just being He's just having those days. I don't know why. Every time I sit down, I try to record. He he acts like this. But anyhow, guys, let's jump right in. <laughs> okay, guys. So I'm going to start brushing my brows. And I like to use, I discovered this NYX, um, the brow glue. I'll like just give them a little lift. As you guys see, guys, I don't have brows. My life would be amazing with brows. I mean, my life would be much more easier. But... I don't have my brows, so I'm just going to comb them with this brow gel. And I feel like it's better versus than that one little pan where you scrape. It messes up the bristles from the brush. And I mean, I love this. I got this off of Amazon. So if you guys haven't tried this, go ahead and give it a try. So there. I like to go probably two times into it. Just brushing them back and forth. And just like that. So... I'm going to go ahead and turn on my compressor, the compressor for my brows. I'm going to go ahead and use the Dynara Pro Compressor. And then, as you guys know, my favorite color, I'm going to go ahead and use Underground. So I do have links and codes and discounts for you guys. Well, thank you. It's down below, guys. Check it out. I do earn a small commission, so thank you guys from the bottom of my heart. So I'm going to go ahead and turn on my compressor. I'm going to do my best for this video not to be long. I'll probably go back and edit. So I'm going to go ahead and shake that bottle and then I'm gonna be using about two drops of underground and this was one of my first colors and actually it has been my favorite brow color it is an eyeshadow but I like it for my brows <laughs> alright guys so I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows what as you guys know whatever I do to one side I do to the other so yeah so I'm going to go ahead and do one brow and then I show you how the other one looks just barely make it. So, look guys. So I'm not going to talk as I say, as I do. It's probably going to take me like a good minute or so. My compressor has been acting up. I don't know why it just turned off on me. I'm gonna leave it right there. It's like five years old. Look at this, guys. And when I'm telling you I don't need no concealer, I don't use con any concealer. Okay. All I'm going to do, my mom just sent me a message. She's going to call me right now. She's funny. 
there's times where I don't pick up when she calls, calls, calls. <laughs> hmm. My mama. She probably watched this video too. She loves watching my videos. She'll comment. So, yeah. So what? This took less than two minutes, guys. And look at this, guys. These are my brows. Let me see if you guys can see up close. Do you guys like it? Do you feel like I do them too thick? Leave them as is. Let me know down below. Comment. And don't forget to like this video because it helps me so, so much, guys. So, yeah. This is what my brows, my brow looks like. So, I'm going to go ahead and do the other one off camera. All right. So, my brows are done. And then I'm going to move on to my brows. Yeah, I know. So I'm going to go ahead and do a brow color and I'm going to go ahead and grab my vanilla and I'm going to do is just two drops of it. So I already cleaned my airbrush gun. I'm gonna spray that tissue. It's coming out good. You could do freehand. I like to do freehand or use your stencil. Make sure you don't hit that brow color otherwise your brows will turn gray. There's my highlight. I hope you guys can see. Yeah, you guys can. I like that little pop right there. Okay, so that is my brow color. And next, we're going to move on. I was thinking like a pinky tone. What do you guys think? Like a pink tone? Let me go ahead and look for my vanity. Vanity is right here. Ah, I ran out. Where's the other one? Okay, let me look for it really quick, guys. So I couldn't find Vanity, and I'm gonna go ahead and just use my opalescent date night. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab about two drops of that. Remember, I always like to spray that tissue before spraying myself. So I'm gonna go ahead and add it to my whole eyebrow. My whole viral wow. My whole eyelid. And a little bit above because remember guys, I do have hoodie eyes. So I like to kind of pull my eye just a bit. And then add that color. And the best tip here is just spray and dry. And I did it a little bit more in the inner corner for a little pop. Okay, so that is one side. Let me go ahead and finish the other side. Okay, I think. Okay, let me go ahead and do the other side. All right, guys. So I'm just finishing up eye number two. Let's call it eye number one, eye number two. So I think I'm just going to relax my eyes. Just a little bit more over here. And that's it. Yes. Yeah, so this is my brown brown color, guys. And I'm going to go ahead and do about three drops of that. And I'm going to spray that tissue. Okay. So as you guys see, um, I have nothing on the outer V and I'm just going to lightly just build up that color on the outer V just a bit just to darken it out. And then lightly I'm going to bring it across just a bit. Just a bit. We don't want to go too crazy. Just a bit. Just like that. I'm gonna probably bring it in more, a little bit more into the inner, just a little bit. Mm-hmm, Papa. Tienes que hablar. So my baby just turned two. <laughs> Last week. Okay, guys. So this is with Found Brown. Right there, just the outer V just darkened. And then I'm gonna also get that found brown and bring it on the bottom of my eye just a little bit. But I'm a puppy. Puppy. Okay, he wants me to do him a happy face. There you go, puppy. Okay. I'm gonna go ahead and do my bottom. I don't know if you guys saw that, just like that. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the eyeliner. 
So the eyeliner that I like to use, either the black by the FX or the Glamour Jet Black, both work great on me. So I'm just going to add three drops. And then I like to spray that tissue. Also guys, I like to clean that tip because I'm going to do my eyeliner. I want it nice and smooth. Okay. So I think I'm going to go ahead and do freehand with the eyeliner. So here goes nothing guys. guys can see or hold on let me bring you guys up close just a little bit let me let me let me zoom you guys just a little bit more let me see did I zoom out yeah I zoomed out duh okay I zoomed you guys just a bit hopefully that works good Look at the eyeliner guys let me know if you guys can see the eyeliner just put yes we saw the eyeliner okay and then I'm gonna go ahead and do the bottom as well so lately I've been skipping eyeliner I've just been loving this effect like this smoked out liner that the airbrush gives so this is with the liner and let me go ahead and do the other side yes now I'm just gonna pop on my lashes because you know this look cannot be complete without the lashes so I'm gonna go ahead and grab my lashes the lashes that I will be using are the Kelly and this is the Florida one I'm gonna go ahead and leave her link down below so this is the lashes I've been using which I've been loving Alright guys, so my lashes are on. Look at that. I hope you guys can see how beautiful they look in person. It looks amazing. Thank you Kelly for sending me your lashes. Um, another thing, I like to go, whatever's left from my black eyeliner, I like to go ahead and do one more pass. Oops, and this is why I like to spray. Make sure you always spray that tissue before spraying yourself. Okay, better. So I'm gonna go ahead and just go over that lash band. So there guys, I went over that lash band. You know when you guys take off your previous lashes and that, and that color from your eyeshadow comes on? That's what I'm doing. So I'm modifying everything and it's looking pretty good. Actually, it looks pretty good. So there, guys. So what I'm going to do, I'm going to go ahead and just clean out my airbrush gun really quick. So you guys can see, I still have color. You can see? I know, papi. ¿Qué hiciste travieso? I'm just like, I'm thinking at the same time. I'm like, okay, is this recording? <laughs> I'm telling you, I go crazy once in a while. <gasps> Primer that I like from Tem2. This one's like 25 bucks. It's amazing. If you guys head over to Tem2 Pro or Tem2.com, um, you guys see the benefits of this primer. It's only like 25. I said it two times right now. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead. And, yes, puppy. So I'm gonna go ahead and do it on my nose oil and just bring it in a little bit on my forehead. And I just do this. So it mattifies everything. Your pores, everything. Okay. Just a little drop. A little drop goes a little long way. So I'm going to go ahead and use my compressor. Guys, I know you guys been singing. I don't know if you guys, I usually use the cordless or the compressor. So I used to have this one, guys, which is the Tem2 2.0. And I recently got the Tem2 Pro Plus. Oh. Okay, Calizzo, are you climbing up on my stuff? No, okay. Calizzo, so I'm going to add a little bit of drop. So this is the perfect canvas. I haven't had the opportunity to use the SB line pretty soon, I promise. But meanwhile, I'm using the Temp2 Perfect Canvas. With this one, you could do it with your hands, brush, or Beauty Blender. I tried it all. It works. So I'm going to go ahead and use it on my airbrush today. 
like drops and this is what my face looks like without any foundation and guys remember I am a light coverage person dame esto just getting my colors no papi no papi me lo vas a tumbar he is a troll my god I'm telling you he's a troll my god ok guys so I'm gonna go ahead and spray By the way, I know I have so many new people, guys. If you guys want to do whatever concealer you like, you guys are more than welcome. I'm going to skip. I I felt like sneezing. I'm going to skip on my um concealer. Concealer, yeah, concealer. I'm just going to go ahead and do a foundation pass. I have done a full face airbrush makeup. It was so amazing to see. Because it was my first time ever doing a full coverage. And I really liked it, but I felt it wasn't for me. So I like to get my stencil again just to cover up. And on my forehead, I don't need as much. Did you guys see that? <laughs> and I don't worry too much right here because I'm going to contour anyways. <laughs> So this is, for me, half foundation, and then just half without. Hopefully you guys can see. So I'm going to go ahead and grab my SB line, and these are the starter kits. I have the blush, the highlight, and the contour one. So if you guys don't know what colors to grab, I definitely, definitely suggest to get yourself some starter kits. That way you play around with different colors and after a while you'll know what colors you love the most. And then buy the big ones. Why not, right? So these are like the big bottles. Let me show you guys comparison to the mini ones and the big bottles. So this is the biggest and this is the smallest. So again, these are my starter kits and this is the SB line. They also have it on the Perfect Canvas. Perfect Canvas is more of a semi-matte. And SB is more of a dewy. But it's once it sets, it sets Mom. beautiful. So I'm going to go ahead and Mom. bronze up my face. Yes, puppy. I'm going to go ahead and grab color 80. And remember, guys, it may look like I'm not using a lot in camera because I have so many light, fake lights in front of me. But in person and outside, it looks amazingly Mom. natural, beautiful, and glowy. So I'm going to go ahead and grab 85. 85. And again, I'm going to grab just a couple of drops. One, two, three. Hi, so for bastante. So this is what 85 looks like. So I'm spraying that tissue. It's coming out. Once it's out, let's start contouring. Or bronzing. So usually when I have going when I got to, when I have too much going on in my eyes, I like to keep it simple on my cheeks. And when I don't have so much going on in my eyes, I like to go harsh on my cheeks. So for me, I know you guys can hardly see, but for me, I'm going to stop there just a bit. I'm not going to go too crazy. And as you guys see, this is a light color. It's not too harsh. So for me, this is beautiful. Hope you guys can pick up. So without and with. But I know you guys can see that hollow right there. Like right here. I know you guys can see it right there. That's what I love to see. So I'm going to go ahead and do the other side as well. So I am done there, guys. And I am not going to clean out my airbrush gun. I'm going to keep that contouring color right there. Obviously, nothing is coming out. Okay, it's all gone. And then I'm going to go ahead and grab my favorite color, which is Waba. I'm telling you guys, you get to play with all these colors. And then you're like, okay, I don't like this. I love this. And I love that. So I'm going to go ahead and get my Waba color. As you guys see, it is very, very, like a very bright coral pink blush so it's gonna settle down with that 
contouring shade that I got that I have in there. So I'm, again, I'm going to add a couple of drops. Spray that tissue. Okay. And then here goes nothing. And here goes nothing. guys can see that color I know you guys can see it let me turn around there you go I know you guys can see it right there so I'm trying to get like the perfect angle for you guys so as you guys see without and with I love it so let me go ahead and do the other side as well so I'm gonna go ahead and grab my temp to cleaner and a little bit of drops and then spray it out Alright, so for my highlight, Mom. yes, for my highlight, I'm going to go ahead and grab, I always use champagne. I feel like that one's my favorite one, guys. Why not? I'm going to go ahead and grab it. I love it. <laughs> so I'm going to go ahead and grab my favorite color, which is highlight, which is the SB Champagne. This is number 53. And then for the SB color that I used for Wawa, it was 46. So it was 85 for contour. 46 oh, 46 for Waba and 53 for Highlight so I'm going to go ahead and shake that color so I'm really obsessed with this color so this is what champagne looks like just going to add a couple of drops that tissue is coming out okay guys so hope you guys can see it without any highlight guys I feel like I talk too much thank you daddy I need to put it full up so this is with highlight look at that glow guys instant glow a little bit on my cupid's bowl Oh yeah, definitely see it. So I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side as well. Let's see guys. All I'm gonna do is grab a little bit of my NYX Butter Gloss, which is the tiramisu. Just a little bit guys. And there you go guys. This is my final look doing a complete full face airbrush makeup look. If you guys see from side to side. Hope you guys can capture this beauty, this glow. I get so happy, like so happy when I get, when I conquered or when I accomplish this beautiful airbrush makeup look without messing up. It feels such an amazing relief. And as you guys see, I don't know if you guys can see, I have a little bit of um a little bit of a uh, makeup on my hair all I do is just go in with the wipey and then just rub it off it comes out good but once your makeup is set and there nothing moves everything is there so yeah guys this is what my makeup looks well guys thank you guys so much from the bottom of my heart don't forget to give it a big thumbs up it really helps and I will see you guys on the next time by now today is Wednesday hopefully I could sit down later on in the night and just edit and have it for you guys Thursday evening or afternoon so yeah guys a big thumbs up and I will guys see you guys and I will see you guys next time <laughs> bye now say bye bye puppy Dile bye bye where's your hand bye bye he's been here with me the whole time and I don't know if you guys could pick up Elmo Every time he sees the lights, he's over here with me. He's just right here. He's just, I don't know. All right, guys, I have to go. But I know. <laughs> One little thing before I forget, guys. Um, I have with me the Temp2 Rainbow. And this is a limited time edition. I think it's going to be ending soon I, in these couple of days. So definitely check that out. They do have a sale going on. I think it's the foundation with the compressor or the compressor and a little pot with the tanning. I'll leave the link down below guys but look at this beauty I completely forgot to use it today but you guys see me use my either black or my gold compressor but look at this compared to these three it is beautiful the gold one is a little dirty 
<laughs> but yeah guys definitely check that out and that's pretty much it bye